A group of distinguished judges and attorneys heard 10 high schools face off last week at the Ohio Moot Court competition. This isn't your average mock trial event. Moot Court involves an oral argument appealing a case that has already been heard by a district court. It is not a mock trial. There are no witnesses and no objections. The students have to think on their feet. Oh, definitely. Having to respond to judges' questions, it's a big contrast to mock trial. It's definitely a lot more intimidating. The moot court competition is hosted by the Ohio Center for Law-Related Education. It provides students with an opportunity to strengthen their understanding of the U.S. Constitution and judicial system. The students have to hone their oral argument skills. Just when you're in the middle of an argument, a judge forces students to engage. Wouldn't that suggest to the reasonable person that a comedic group from within the school was responsible? And wouldn't that be individualized suspicion, at least as to each individual who's a member of that group? No. It was terrifying because it's like, what if you just don't know how to answer or like you blank or something? It's, and they're so powerful and important people. I mean, they're amazing at what they do. So The judges range from practicing attorneys to even Ohio Supreme Court Justice Pat Fisher. It's a skill of standing up and speaking to a group of people and defending your viewpoint. And it's not a skill that is developed usually in schools these days, but it's a skill, whether they go into law or some business or something, they'll have to stand up in front of people and give a speech or defend what their presentation is to their boss. It is a skill that they could use forever. The final courtroom face-off took place between Springfield High School and Gilmore Academy in Lake County. And the winner is the Gilmore Academy team. The Springfield High School team didn't walk away empty-handed. They came in second place. We're happy to say the least. You know, I had a long day of work getting up early and being questioned by justices all day is stressful, but in the end it all pays off. It's a great honor to be here. Congratulations to Gilmore High School. I'm Ann Yeager for Court News Ohio.